Hello, it's Doris with Aldi Books and my books are struggling to fit on my bookshelf. So let's see what we can do about that. Speaking of not fitting, I made this soft little bed for Guy and this is where he's choosing to nap this morning. Um, that doesn't look very cozy to me. And it's a bit of a tight fit, but, you know, as long as he likes it. So, I need to get the Tower of Doom out of the window and on the top row of this cart so that I can start the 2021 Tower of Doom, obviously. <laughs> uh, but I still have my South Africa project in the cart. And... Um, yeah, I do have this space available, but that's where I keep my, um, books I've just finished for the month, so I guess I can move that elsewhere. Um, but also, my nonfiction shelf that, you know, that I've already read is getting really full. So I was going to move make this my nonfiction shelf because like a couple months ago this shelf was getting kind of skinny as books moved to the card of chaos. But you know I went on a buying spree apparently and so <laughs> this shelf is full again. This is my TBR shelf and this is my nonfiction TBR shelf. But there's a little bit of nonfiction on here as well just if it fits into a category like um my black history shelf or my um hispanic heritage shelf kind of thing so what to do like my nonfiction needs to expand somewhere and i don't know what to say because you know this side's pretty full too. And I already bought a new shelf a few months back for my graphic novels and memoirs and Australian lit. So I must, I must analyze the situation and see. I'm gonna try to stack, like to make a few more of these kinds of stacks because sometimes that holds more books that way. Okay, let's just, let's just start. Let's just do something, <laughs> anything. Okay. <laughs> um, it's a work in progress, obviously. Like my windows are a work in progress. My windows aren't a work in progress. Let's just be honest here. I, I'm not into housework. Um, so anyway, <laughs> my books though, I'm into my books. So I made a little room. My books are a work in progress and I'm going to have to expand the bookcase, the bookcases, um, eventually, but I'm hoping to squeeze out another year with what I've got. So I did make some room. So let's go see what I did. Okay. So my like Latin X shelf, um, is has gotten full this year, which I think that was one of my goals. So that's a good thing. So I bumped my um, Sandra Cisneros up there. Uh, so that's good. And I still have plenty of room in my Middle Eastern shelf. So my Black History Month shelves have been full for a while, but I did put the books stacked like that, the little ones there. So I have a little more room there, and then I bumped the my Asian reads, so I put my Amy Tan and Lisa C right there, and I still actually have room for my currently read book storage, so that's good. So, um, yeah, bump those over, and then uh, I got my South African reads there. And that, that's got a lot of space, um, but I needed that because 
Don't get seasick. <gasps> what? Where did the Tower of Doom go? I got all of the Tower of Doom in the top level of the Card of Chaos. So awesome. Um, and this is supposed to be empty to um, start a new Tower of Doom when I start my um, haul revisits. I'm so excited to do those again. But um, for now, I had to put my unread South African books there. So those, once I get them read, don't get seasick, um, will go here. So that'll fill up. And then um, this is like I'm the least happy with, but it's fine for now. So, um, yeah, these are my nonfiction that I've read. And this is a weird shelf, like it's wider than the other one. So like I could double stack, but I don't, I don't really like to do that, but it's okay. Um, it's okay. Cause I can see them. So I feel like this is going to last, you know, for a while. And then my TBR shelf looking good. I just tidied it up a little bit and um, that's projects for January. I'm so excited to start filming my project video and my nonfiction TBR shelf. So yeah. Happy shelves, happy reader. Thanks so much for watching and I'll be back soon. Bye.